わびさびの美意識は室町時代から根付いていったと言われていますそこには清く貧しくをよしとする禅宗との結びつきがありました禅寺の生活には今もわびさびが息づいています兵庫県田島地方曹洞州安泰寺で禅寺の一日を見せてもらいました住職を務めるドイツ人のネルケ無法さんですシンプルな生活当たり前の生活をすれば、えー、自然に出てくるのはわびさびだと私が思うんですね安泰寺には現在日本人5人外国人7人の弟子が住み込み修行しています午前4時起床座禅から一日が始まります毎朝2時間座禅は禅の最も重要な修行と言われます座禅との出会いがネルケさんの人生を変えたといいます何のために生きなければいけないのかずっとは若い時そういう考えたんです人生の意味って何だろうと思い悩んでいた高校時代に座禅を体験それは衝撃的な出会いでした姿勢を整えると、まあ、自分も変わるしこの周りの世界まで変わって見える感じられるというような。ゆくゆくは日本に渡って全村になりたいという夢がもう高校生の頃にあったんですね大学で日本語を勉強卒業後日本に移り住み25歳で特度安泰寺などで修行を続け33歳で九代目住職に就きました人生を変えた座禅ヌルケさんにとって座禅とはまあ、私がという目がの一端を外すと、うん、もっと360度広い範囲で現実が見えると思いますね。ここで息を吸って息を吐いているのも私心臓が動いているのも私そして小鳥が鳴いているのもそれまでは全然。聞こえなかったんですけれどもあそこに小鳥が鳴いているあパラパラと雨が降っているでそれも自分とつながっている座禅によって目が大きく開かれたといいます座禅の後は朝食毎日変わらない汁玄米野菜のシンプルな食事です食事中は一切の死後を慎み食べることに集中しますしっかりと味わい米や野菜の命をいただくことに感謝します食事が終わると布のついた棒で器を丁寧に洗うのです わずかなお湯を無駄なく使いますこの器何十年も受け継がれているそうです食後は掃除そして日中は寒と呼ばれる作業安泰寺は自給自足しながら宅発で生計を立てています米や季節の野菜ハーブも栽培しています野菜が取れない時は山菜で賄います除草剤を使わないため草取りは欠かせません
農作業は毎日6時間いつでもコンビニがあって欲しいものがいつでも手に入ると逆にその感謝の気持ちが薄れてくると思いますね。ものがないとあここにわらびとかここにふきが、えー、あるとそれに感謝してまたその味がもう深くなるというかう違うんですよね。これが禅で重要な樽を知るという考え方。今ここにあるこの現実に落ち着いてそれ以上のものいらないものまで求めないということですまず知足の心がないとわびさびもわからないかもしれません夜の座禅で禅寺の一日が終了ネルケさんにとってわびさびとはわびさびは人生の隠し味とと言っていいと思い思ますね一見何の刺激もないけれどもあなんだこれで十分だったというか命というかこれが自然なんだという,うそういう、うん、ささやかな気づきではないかと思いますね。わびさびの喜びが今も生活に根付いている禅寺の暮らしいかがですかいやーこれはできんけどなあいいですねさあどうもよさてる天気いらいらいらどうだ um, It's nice but I wouldn't do it I don't think you need to dig that deep to Understand wabi sabi, you can just point them to, you know, in the right direction and they'll get it themselves.、Uh, I'm impressed because,、uh, I mean, I could see most people adopting some, some, you know, concepts of Zen in their own life, you know, but going to that kind of extreme degree where they're just embracing everything within their own life, I'd be interested to ask them really what their reasons were.、Mm -hmm. it's, it's what he was saying in the interview that. We're so used to the convenience store and everything being so easy, like available for us. So we long for that feeling. Like, even though、uh, you don't have to go in the forest and do what they were doing to feel the wabi sabi feeling, but we all are looking for that. In France,、uh, if I'm not mistaken, it's in the dictionary actually. The, it's mostly the component which is mostly retained is、uh, being you know,、mm. calm, don't, don't, don't get your, your head heated, and you know, try to think about the situation.、Mm. For many Israelis, like, Zen represents the Japanese culture. Like,、uh, this is for them like, something that represents Japanese culture, even though they don't like, know is, like, really like, in detail what does it mean and everything.、So mm. Yeah, I mean, amongst a, a small group of people, it's quite、uh, you know, popular. It became a bit Quite trendy、uh, a handful of years ago. And now many people do meditation, for example. In the US, it is popular. It's not really connected with religion. It's sort of marketed、mm. as、uh, like a minimalist design or lifestyle concept.、Mm. I've heard the term、um, Zen influence design, you know, and maybe like a stress reliever like Zen meditation.、Mm. VTR の中で言ってたあの樽を知るっていうのは皆さんの国でも受け入れられると思いますか I see the value of that chisoku is that、oh. you know, you're always pursuing happiness. You're always pursuing it. You, know, you always want more money, bigger house, and everything. So I'm wary of concepts that say, be happy with what you have. You know, everybody, you should just be happy with what you have. So then I could go and get more.、Mm. <laughs> the US is, fun,、uh, is founded on capitalism, and there's this strive to always get more than someone else. Tokyo, especially, we're so stimulated by things all the time like light, light, noise, people, like even just Shibuya. Like, it's just like an addiction almost. Like, so it's this kind of being more zen and being more connected to and being more humble and removing the ego, as he was saying.、Mm. It's actually really cool.、Mm.
Also, like Orthodox can. Jewish living like a very similar life to Zen uh, priests. They pray from morning till dawn. They don't have like yeah, they don't they kind of like ignore the other like the the the, the outside world and they have their house are very simple. Like mm -hmm. they don't have any. So in a way, in a very abstract way, it it, it it's like uh, it, it it works on the same uh, the same state of mind. But it's it's uh, connected strongly connected to Japanese mm -hmm. culture, which is very very admirable in Israel people like Israeli people. So I think you can find people that have interest uh, in Zen from different uh, pl from like different backgrounds and different like a businessman or wabi-sabi wabi-sabi is wabi-sabi because it's in Japan but if I looked at a tree that is coming out of the cement like you did mm. in Yanaka I wouldn't feel oh it's wabi-sabi in my country I for me it's wabi-sabi because it's here in a Japanese context in Russia, for example, it would be very, very hard to find examples of wabi-sabi. Mm -hmm. So therefore, it would be very hard to mm -hmm. have people understand the feeling. Wabi-sabi is something that uh, it's either you, you feel it or you don't. It's either you want to understand it or, and you, or you don't. And mm -hmm. it's, it really depends on the person. あの、ごっことしてならゼンにちょっと近づけるんで日本人も善はなかなか難しいけど善ごっこなら行けるだろうっていう感じがしました。なんとかごっこというの文化の面では非常に力があるんでごっこの段階だからわびさびっていうのは皆